Psalms chapter 83, verses 2. For lo, thine enemies make a tumult, and they that hate thee have lifted up their heads. They have taken crafty counsel against thy people, and consulted against thy hidden ones. They have said, Come, let us cut them off from being a nation that the name of Israel may be no more in remembrance. For they have consulted together against they have consulted together with one consent. They are co confederate against thee. Double honors to the elect of GMS preaching his word in truth and sincerity and anyone teaching likewise doctrine. King Jesse back with another Bible lesson. <clears throat> Before we go into the lesson, Yahweh is who you ignorantly call God. Yahweh Shah is who you ignorantly call Jesus Christ. The Rakakadash is the Holy Spirit. And Bahashem means in the name. So when you call on your God, you call on the name of Yahweh Bahashem Yahweh Shah. You no longer call on the fake names of Jesus Christ. So when you call on your Lord and Savior, you call on the name of Yahweh Shah. The letter J was invented in 1524. Remember that. <clears throat> okay, we're going to go into this lesson. Um, basically, uh, going uh, call this one the Crafty Council, aka a New World Order. And I got a video I wanted to play, and that Bible verse goes perfectly with the video I'm about to play. You got it. Georgia Guidestones, too. Perfect. That is the uh, work of them as well. And I, I got one more video I want to show yeah. you guys as well. Uh,
your chip digitally. Total control. Total control. And if you're like me or you, and you're protesting what they're doing, then you just turn off your chip. And you have nothing. You can't buy food. You can't do anything. It's total control of the people. And that's just going to... Let's skip ahead. Just like they want the right to vote. You know, and they start to laugh and you're an idiot. And I said, why am I an idiot? He said, you want me to tell what that was about? We do not have to funded that. We funded Women's Lib, you know? And we're the ones who got all of the newspapers and television, the Rockefeller Foundation. He says, and you want to know why? He said, there were two primary reasons. And they were, one reason was we couldn't tax half the population before Women's Lib. And the second reason was now we get the kids in school at an early age. We can indoctrinate the kids how to think. And so it just breaks up the family. The, the, the kids start looking at the state as the family, as the school, as the officials, as their family, not as the parents teaching them. And so those are the two primary, the primary reasons for women's living, which, which I put up to that point was a noble thing. You know, but when I saw their intentions behind it, where they were coming from, when they created it, the thought of it, I saw, I saw the evil behind what I thought was an open adventure. Well, what it is, is I remember we were friends, and we used to have, we used to my house a lot, we'd have dinner, we'd talk, and they'd tell me about business investments, they'd get involved in, you know, or they would help me with this business investment or that business investment, and was interested in joining the Council on Foreign Relations, you know, I would have to get a letter to join them, but was I interested in that? And, uh, you know, just uh, just stop, you know, leading you on. And, and uh, I have to say to him that I never really did that because well, that wasn't where I was coming from. And as much as I like you, Nick, you know, your way is in my ways where the other, where the other side Listen up, listen up. You know, I don't believe in enslaving people, you know, and... Um,
the wicked. And that's a, these are all Rothschild, Rockefellers. They all descend from the family. They're all descendants of these people. They're the wicked. This so called, uh, oh, yeah, we got, I got another one I wanted to end it with. Not the, with this one, but uh, we're gonna bring it back. 80, uh, Psalms 83 and 2 For lo, thy enemies make a tumult, and they that hated thee have lifted up thy head. They, they're plotting against the children of Israel to get everyone what chipped up, right? Just like Anthony Russo said in the interview, right? Second Thessalonians 2 and 3. Let no man deceive you by any means, for they, or that day shall not come, except there come a falling away first, and the man of sin be revealed, the son of perdition. Uh, verse number 4. Who opposes and exalts it, himself above all that is called God or that is worshipped so that he as God sitteth in the temple of God showing himself that he is God and the man of sin that's going to be revealed is so called Esau the Edomites so called white man the European race they're going to be real and they're being revealed right now before our very eyes all their wickedness is coming to the forefront so, I'm going to go ahead and end the lesson with that. Uh, New World Order, Crafty Council. And this lesson by saying, Call the Law Yahweh, Bahashim Yahweh Shah, Bahashim Rakat Adash, Barakat Yahweh, Barakat Yahweh Shah, Barakat Yahweh, Barakat Yahweh Shah, Call the Law Yahweh, Bahashim Yahweh Shah.